I can't shoot. I can't shoot. No. <laughs> Classical World of Tanks matchmaking right now. 15 to 5. Extremely unbalanced. But hey. We get uh, brighter uh, tracers, at least. Uh. Today, when I woke up, I didn't need breakfast because I was not hungry for some food, but instead for some absolutely mad lad destruction. RNG shots, out of this world penetrations and shells guided by Stalin himself. And there is no better vehicles to do that in with other than the one and only. The mighty Object 704. I do believe that uh, we can call this legendary PLT and gun what 704 possesses, one of the most devastating and deadliest boomsticks in this game called World of Tanks. Still, uh, because if you have not played this game for many years, uh, you do not remember that back in the days we had a tier 8 vehicle, one tank before 704, IHU 152 featuring exactly the same gun with the same stats 286 millimeters of penetration with standard rounds 750 alpha damage and the destruction that gun did in those matchmakings where ISU was top of the tier or even like versus tier 9s. The destructions are simply uncountable. So many glorifying words, but hey, we have to warm up this RNGs somehow and uh, hopefully Stalin is going to uh, guide our shots today as well because this is what we are going to do in today's video. And by the way, quick flexing action, like I'm not able to do that super often. I was just uh, able to free mark this vehicle as well and uh, I can say it was absolutely pleasant uh, free marking experience and quickly, uh, let's do quick another flex over here uh, no this one this one let's go right over here uh, at the moment currently in june uh, 2021 uh, compared to anyone who has played more than 50 battles with it we are number one we are actually number one by wr rating uh, win ratio average damage right over here and uh, more than 500 yeah around oh, over 500 people have actually played so over 50 battles with it so not bad guys like i'm not able to see myself at the very top of the too often so I am going to cherish this moment right over here and this is actually the full setup I um, used to free mark this vehicle as well maybe a bit different setup most likely a bit different setup what you are using uh, but uh, here is my crew like I absolutely love this tank you know quite a beast crew over here with brothers in arms I am using a tank on rammer just for the increased DPM you know DPM 3350 like not too many tanks can um, feature this DPM right uh, then go to the optics because uh, stock view range is absolute garbage and even with uh, bounty go to the optics this is for 456 you know slightly above uh, 445 even with food and um, as kind of a unique uh, feature over here i am using this um, bounty aiming minus eight percent to the aiming circle size i like to think that many times it is going to help me out and uh, food and this directive as well because i have as uh, i had so many of them do i not have any more well, uh, I think I do not have any more in the depot. Anyway, I had a ton of them, but uh, because this was the setup, I'm going to use the same setup in today's video. Without further ado, let's jump into our first battle, and hopefully RNGesus has been warmed up. Okay, what do we have over here is... Uh, wow, what a nice matchmaking, actually. No artilleries, one light tank. Is this true? Is this... I should record every single battle I play. I, I should actually record every single battle I play from now on. Because this matchmaking is beautiful. We have tier 8s, we have tier 10s, we have tier 9s. But I can say, usually uh, 704 doesn't care about who it is going to face. Un unless, you know, triple tier 10 RT. This is quite painful to receive hits from tier 10 RT. Uh, but... Um, <clears throat> In a nutshell, am I shooting tier 8 tanks, am I shooting tier 10 tanks, it does not matter. Uh, this tank can penetrate absolutely every single tank um, into their weak spots. Even mouse, you know, is going to be penetrated by standard rounds. So let's try to do exactly that right over here. Uh, still waiting for my first uh, target. There is Scorpion, who is going to be punished actually quite a bit. Let me just tell you that. Into the Booper, 731 damage. A low roll. Our blessing did not work exactly as promised, ladies and gentlemen. Our blessing is not like 100%... Um, Hardcore, but hey, 842. Okay, gun needed to be a bit warm. Gun needed to be warmed up a bit. Come on, take that beautiful blind shot. Please take that beautiful blind shot. Um, 
That was meant for... That was meant to be a blind shot as well. Okay, they have three dank destroyers over there. Uh, I actually do not want to go in versus three dank destroyers. I actually don't want to go in. Okay, there is Lynx. Oh yeah. I will help you. I will help you, Lynx. Whatever you get up to, you have my back. That shot may be a hit, maybe not. I, d I don't want to be straight in the bush because usually uh, that bush gets um, quite um, hardcore countered all the time. So this is the BL-10 gun. You can see that most of the times it is actually quite accurate. Even though on the paper it is not super accurate. But I have the accuracy equipment unit as well, so this may help it out. Uh, hopefully it is helping it out, otherwise that equipment unit would be useless, right? Don't pen him, please. Oh, that actually penned him with AP round, though. Uh, a penetration, 704, uh, 705, sorry. He's using that over there to hide his tank. Oh my god, I have actually hit most of my shots. Wait a minute. How much HP did that guy have before? How much HP did that guy have before? Did we actually penetrate him before blindly? Look at that. And boom. Oh my god, okay, so this is... This is the BL-10 gun, ladies and gentlemen, we all know and love. We have destroyed almost every single... Oh, we dodged. We dodged. Enemy 268. We dodged that guy. We did indeed dodge that guy. The Scorpion is coming in as well. And... Oh my god, it went into the upper plate. And this guy is getting flanked. That's the that's the thing I was waiting. And hopefully I'm uh, driving away. Hopefully we're getting away from the uh, U68 as well in time. Please don't blind fire me. Please don't hit me blind. And boom. I had to be fast. I had to be faster than uh, uh, 405. And this game is a GG, boys. This game is a GG. I do believe we don't have any blind shots. At least I don't think so. Maybe one into 268. No, I don't. I don't think so. So 3,900 damage done overall right now. Mm, as a first battle, I do take that actually. I honestly do take that. Look at that beautiful uh, field right over here. So another classical world of tanks matchmaking right now 15 to 5 extremely unbalanced which makes it uh, more and more unfun it's under five minute battle like oh but hey we get uh, brighter uh, tracers at least uh, with update 1.13 we get brighter tracers we get brighter tracers yeah so we get something, boys. We get something. Anyway, this was the first battle. Fantastic call. Fantastic this, right? Top damage. Yay. And uh, let's go into another one. Let's see how that one goes. BL10, be blessed again. And another triple tier matchmaking. This time, one artillery. Let's see how it goes. Two light tanks. Uh, do we have two light tanks? Yes, we have two light tanks. Light tank wise, it is uh, okay, actually. So looking at... Ooh, uh, wow, look at the tier 10s. This is uh, this is actually copy based D57, D57, Brochetto, Brochetto, Krilla 15, Krilla 15, exactly copy based. Hmm, okay. I would like to see more, but we have better artillery, so hopefully we're going to win, right? Because M5355 should be the best artillery tier by tier in this game right now, shouldn't it, right? Okay, so let's start off with some blind shots. That shot was a miss, sadly, but I am not giving up. I am not giving up. Um, I did get spotted. Uh, did I get spotted? Hmm, two light tanks, boys. Two light tanks. Okay, let me... Oh, 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 oh. okay, that guy got spotted. Watch this, watch this. Yep, I was actually going to take that blind shot, but uh, my blind shot would have been a miss. My blind shot would have been a slight miss, actually. I was about to take that blind shot because I got spotted in a very weird angle. The only, uh, the only place where you can get spotted... Uh, from is right here where that guy was actually uh, so let's take a now blind shot anyone over there still nothing over there still nothing okay brochetto 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 i'm actually going after that guy 
I am actually going after this Progetto if I am able to do that. I'm actually going after you. If I'm going to have a chance to punish you a bit, you know. Not too much punishment, just, you know, a little, that little bit. Oh, there is Shara Futur. Shara Futur, are you coming up a bit higher? I need you to come. Ah, that was a bad lead. That was on me. That was 100% on me, boys. That was simply on me. But there is Scorpion G. That was clean. Almost a hit. Uh, Boresk and Sharfutur. Okay, now I can go after Sharfutur. And T92 is in that push, ladies and gentlemen. They are all coming in. And boom! Boo! Yeah! Just like that. Just like that, we have D57 heavy problem in the base, ladies and gentlemen. We have D57 heavy problem in the base. Well, we can say that we have quite a lot of problems right now everywhere around us. Standard B, Shard Futur. Uh, and this is going to be a... What did we win the previous battle? 15 to 3, right? We did win it 15 to 3, so it is our time to lose it 3 to 15. Seems to be the case. Uh, 57 up here. I don't want to get spotted, you know, for absolutely no reason. You know what would make my day? If those guys are actually pushing in aggressively and they absolutely forget about me, which that guy did, and the low roll RNG dices didn't roll as um, as needed. Did not roll as needed, so 22 hit points. Uh, that guy actually, you know, I'm going to do, hopefully, never mind. I got saved. I got saved. I'm going to take on that D30. I know Sharfutur is going to punish me. Um, I'm getting some assistance, I'm getting all the assistance for that, actually. Commander dead now. Beautiful. Emil 2 is coming in. Is Emil 2 coming in? Yes. I can't shoot. I can't shoot! No! <laughs> no, 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 no! You stay over there, little guy. <laughs> no! How, how did you get back up? That is cheating. How did that guy get back up? Do you have a freaking uh, jack, air jack, or whatever they call it? Uh, you know, the jack system, you know, what you use to pump use yourself, your car up. How do you call that, actually? <laughs> this is a stock gun, right, isn't it? Oh, well, okay. We lose. Yeah, we lose. Well, 5,800 combined. I see that as uh, maybe a tiny 20% of a win for myself, but... We did lose this battle as a team anyway. One more. Uno mas. Uno mas. Third battle in a row. Third tier. Ten battle in a row. We were not able to beat the top of the dog in the matchmaking. But as I said, uh, this tank uh, does not care about that too much. Anyway, let's do some sniping at the start. And let's see where we can uh, go with this. Let's quickly hide. Because Shara Futur and AMX 1390 both are damaging my tracks only. Triple RT, I am going to hide in my little nest and I'm not coming out before uh, I have, like, I'm sure I'm not spotted anymore and now I'm sure I'm not spotted anymore, so let's move up. AMX uh, 1390 up here. Uh, Sharfutur actually did not get spotted uh, taking those shots. So maybe that's a bit very worrying, worrisome. I don't know where that guy was and how we didn't spot him. You know, my view range, this tank has uh, quite sad view range, as I said before. Stuff like this can happen. Stuff like this can happen. So where are you going to peak? Where are you going to peak? Let's see, there is D22 actually. D22, A phase 1. No, 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 come back, come back, come back. Beautiful. And a... Just a tiny, tiny Dutch. Just a tiny Dutch too low, that shot was. But, oh, tracked. 
and thank you. Thank you for being a bit too greedy. Received a shot from Arty, received a shot from me, and you were still a bit too greedy. But I too thank you for that, because um, that did put some damage on my board. Uh, light and... Could Light Tank still be over there? I don't know. Let's take the Blanchet, actually. Maybe Light Tank was over there, you know. I don't have any targets to shoot right now anyway. Uh, there is Shot of Wood our D54 die. D54 didn't pay attention what is happening. Minimap, guys. Minimap, I'm saying all the time. Minimap does 50% of the work for you. So, please use it. Okay, all our artists are dead. All our artists are dead, so it seems like it is going to be our time to lose 618. 618. Sadly, I didn't receive any assistance for that. Uh, triple Arty and I am the only one spotted, most likely. It is Triple Arty battle, and most likely I'm the only tank spotted. This is a tier 10 Arty uh, who has uh, more uh, shells in the magazine than simply one, you know. That is Arty number two. And Sharfoot Tour is able to spot me. And I'm dragged out of nowhere. Leopard, I need your help, actually. Yeah, we're getting bombarded from every single angle. And another fast simulator right over here. This time it was our time to lose. Oh my god. It's actually, it's actually sad, you know, what is happening with the matchmaking. I thought we were going to do one epic, fun episode with 704, but hey, it just shows what is so bad about this matchmaking more and more and more. I'm actually going to uh, drop down just like this. And uh, let's try to punish that D30, for example. Can we do? Can we do that? Can we punish those guys without getting spotted? I don't think so, right? There's D30. I believe. I believe I can shoot and I can do some damage under angle like that. That had to be very close. That had to be very close to the ground, you know. Almost not a hit into the ground. Okay, 821. Let's farm some more damage right over here. I am completely out of Arty's shadow. Especially if Arty can fire. Under that uh, other angle as well, you know. And here it is. Let's go for the D30 tank with more hit points. Because I'm not able to kill that other guy anyway. And it is going to be 4 to 15, maybe. Gotta, gotta say that um, our 140 was not super helpful. I wonder how that guy ended up in my blacklist before even, you know. 700. 38. Shard Futura over here. Coming in. Hopefully Light Tank or someone comes in before and I'm able to do some damage, but no. 4 to 15, hey, welcome to World of Tanks. Yes, a fast battle simulator and uh, 6 to 15 actually, because two tanks died after that, after diving down. Hey guys, you need to learn some diving, okay? You need to learn some diving. Anyway, uh, as this is a live battle video, you know everything goes in, we are not cherry picking, we are not doing anything like that. Beautiful people, I still hope you enjoyed it. We had some juicy, juicy RN uh, Jesus Russian number generator, you know, RNG means Russian number generator shots, beautiful penetrations, um, snapshots even uh, into that shot for tour, for example. And yeah, overall, quite a quite quality battles. Uh, what did we average? 3,500 average and 800 assistance, so 4,329.66 average damage after three battles. I hope it does the job. Ladies and gentlemen, my latest third mark, 704, the legendary 704. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, thumbs up button is for that. If you didn't, thumbs down button is for that. Stay tuned for some more sexy action. Catch you soon. Bye-bye.